Uh, I feel like we've been running the screen. We've been trying to practice on our screen since um, the spring. And, you know, we've been doing it. Uh, during, we even did it during summer workouts. So it's like, it's like the most uh, repetition we had at it, it just got easier and easier. And I feel like it paying off in the games. And Urban was talking about how quickly the ball comes out of Dwayne's hands. Is that part of the reason that helps you guys get you're just out moving a little bit quicker than you might have been in the past? Oh, definitely. You know, when he gets the ball out of his hands, we got to be ready, and then it's easier for us to get yards out the catch. You made a lot of big plays so far in your career, but uh, you, you kind of have the signature play, the one that's been played over and over again, the game-winning touchdown against Penn State. What's that like, KJ, when you get like kind of that, that marquee play that I'm sure everybody's you know contacting you? People you probably don't even know. They're acting like your friends. <laughs> yeah, it, you know, uh, it's just like one of those things that makes you happy, you know. Shows, like I told him, just a dream come true, you know, just that play. And um, I wouldn't ever be able to do it without Austin and uh, Terry with their blocking. So I get a big shout out on that, too. You guys take a lot of pride in that. I know the blocking, that's been the staple around here for a long time. You guys feel like you're the best, you probably feel like you're the best wide receiving group in the country, but are you, are you specifically the best blocking wide receiving group? Oh, yeah, definitely, because we got to have it all, you know. We try to uh, emphasize on being different, you know, we got all these receivers. Uh, cores around the country, but what makes you different? So I feel like our blocking make us different, and um, definitely uh, yards after catching, catching the ball. KJ, your coaches have told us that this team is pretty far away from reaching its ceiling. How much of your potential have we seen as a team? I feel like as a team, just a little because we grow every game. You know, every game we come closer, and I feel like we made a big step during Penn State. We uh, grew as a team and uh, as offense. How did you grow? Like, what did you take from that? Uh, we uh, just believing in each other, you know. Never put your head down. We fought through it together, you know. We just gained a, a closer bond even throughout that. KJ, it looked like you were auditioning for the uh, Ohio State band drum major as you went into the end zone there. <laughs> nah, I was just high stepping, you know, Dean yeah. Sanders. What did what is that? We didn't get to talk to you after the game, uh, which is too bad, but what was that feeling like? A game like that, a comeback like that, the most critical game, obviously, up to this point for this football team. What was it like as you pranced into the end zone? What did it, what were you thinking? What were you feeling? Well, I felt like, well, I heard nothing. You know, the crowd was silent. You could yeah. hear a pencil dropping. So that was, I feel like that was the best feeling you could. Uh, make a crowd get quiet like that. I yeah. feel like that's the best feeling. But on the inside, were you? I mean, what was the pride factor, or whatever? How you guys scrambled back in that game? What? You know, ex explain it, that. It didn't hit you to like you got on the bus or on the plane, be like, and you watching ESPN. You be like, we really just did that. You yeah. Know? Uh, but I mean, inside it just feels real good, you know, just to be able to go through that adversity and uh, fight out of it and um, overcome it. It just made you feel. Great as a player and great as a team. What, what was it like at, at halftime, KJ? You know, you guys uh, scramble back from 13 down, then you take a, a small lead, and then, of course, you know, get, get down by 12 there with eight minutes to go. Uh, on the sideline there, I mean, was there any kind of, like, you know, emotion running, like some guys, you know, you guys are trying to hype each other up, like, come on, we still got this with even with eight minutes left? Nah, I feel like with their halftime, we made our adjustments with the coaches, you know, offensively. Then when we came out, we – we really was too hype, you know. We had to calm down because the, our drilling was going. You know, the crowd got us into it. We, we just was. Their crowd got you into it. Yeah, our, their crowd was yelling. We just wanted to, you know, hush them up, play good. So we was just, just really, really too hype. You feel me? So I feel like uh, we just had to take a deep breath and come back out and play football. Okay, 